Welcome back. The Mountain Lake area football team is a perfect 3-0 on the season with a matchup against Red Rock Central on tap. Here's a look at both of the nine player teams. Plenty of action early on in this matchup. First quarter, Carl Thurkelson picking up a big chunk of yardage on the ground for Red Rock Central. This offense is just getting started. Jordan Thurkelson drops a dime into the hands of Abraham Staveness to move the chains. Falcons moving the ball well. Cardinal Thurkelson finishes the job, bounces the handoff out of the gun outside. Plenty of real estate for the junior to scoop into the end zone for six to open up the scoring. Here come the Wolverines. Jake Evers drops back to pass. All day to throw, decides to scramble. Senior picks up the first down and more. Evers using the arm now. John Bergman gets behind the defense to put the Wolverines in the red zone. Evers capitalizes later. Design quarterback run. That's a touchdown. Wolverines pick up the win this evening. More nine player action now. Medelia hosting Grenada Huntley East Chain Truman. Jaguars Jackson Madsen with the ball runs outside and he will not be denied. The seniors looking to make a house call on this Friday night and he will. Jaguars in control. Medelia needs a spark now. Chase Osborne on this kick return. The senior gets this all the way out to Medelia's own 40. Later, Osborne passing the ball finds Kyle Peach on the perimeter. Senior is finally drugged down. Blackhawks go to the air again, but Carter Langford says not so fast. He's all over this route for the interception. Jaguars win 36 to 14. The Minnesota State women's soccer team opens up conference play with a matchup against the Concordia St. Paul Golden Bears. Head coach Brian Ball talks about wanting his group to score more goals in the Mavericks do just that in the conference opener. First half of play, the Mavericks are up by two goals after scores from Avery Corshing and Alicia Hoffman. Second half, this group keeps the foot on the pedal. Great action here in the box. Golden Bears fail to clear. Anna Van Wingarn connects from distance. Perfect finish from the junior. And that is the knockout punch this afternoon. Minnesota State wins it by a final of 3-0. Another shutout for the Mavericks. That's four now in five games. MSU off to a great start in NSIC play. The conference action continues Sunday with a matchup against the Augustana Vikings. Now it's time to look at our play of the night. Let's head to Mountain Lake area. The Wolverines defense making plays. Fumble is forced. Ethan Ron with the scoop and the score. You score a defensive touchdown and we're going to call you the Ronimal after that. Mountain Lake area picks up the win in the victory. Usually it's the offense winning play of the night, but not this time. Take another look. Ron grabs a loose ball and takes it all the way to pay dirt. Shout out Tony Peregrine, our photographer, for getting a great shot of the action. That's all the time we have for tonight. We will be here same time, same place next week for another edition of Sports Extra.